come back to you guys. Don't worry. Just stay right here. It seems like there's a lot of bad blood in this it's been going on for years. Um, I, I can I can remember uh, an incident where that took place. I believe it was in Mexico where uh, where uh, Chavez just started talking bad about Canelo that he was a paper champion that he wasn't really uh, a real fighter whatever that whatever that means. Um, but yeah, they just don't like each other. Um, I, genuinely, they just do not care for each other. So this is a very personal fight and. Uh, you know, one that's gonna obviously transpire into into the ring, and uh, I'm I'm really looking forward to a great fight. Yeah, he said he said that basically he didn't get anything from his dad when it comes to the you know, respect from boxing. You know, Canelo did to, about Chavez. Right. No, exactly. And, and look, it, it, it goes it goes both with the father and the son. Uh, for some reason, they they just don't like Canelo. I mean, <laughs> it, maybe it's because he's been. Uh, He's been the face of boxing for a while now, maybe because he's going to carry boxing on his shoulders for many years to come, or because he's been getting more attention. Um, Chavez Sr. had his day, just like mine. You, know, you have to take a back seat sometimes, and, uh, and Chavez Jr., look, it can be his time on May 6th, but he has to go out there and prove it. And, uh, you know, and I, I strongly feel that Chavez Jr. will be in great shape, he'll be in the best shape of his life, and therefore we're going to get a great fight, which obviously boxing needs. Who, do, who does Mexico need for in this one, you know what I mean? You know, we, we actually did a poll, um, and it's, it's, it's almost split down the middle, but Canelo does have more fans. Um, it's, 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 yeah, it's, 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 it's tough to, it's tough to pick. I mean, I think, my, my, my feeling is, look, we have, we have two great Mexican fighters, warriors. I'm excited because we've never seen a fight uh, that's dull or boring with two Mexican fighters. I mean, that's what I'm looking forward to. It's that we're going to get a great fight. And that's exactly what the sport needs. And it reminds me of the fight between you and you and Chavez. It does. I mean, look, I, 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 faced, so I faced a handful of Mexican national champions uh, in the undefeated fighters. One was obviously Julio Cesar Chavez. Uh, uh, and, and they were great fights, you know, so it's, it's, there's something about the pride, there's something about the ego, you know, there's something about you going out there and proving uh, who's the best, because I, I would hate to be the loser and go back to my country, right, Mexico, and go and, and have to answer all those questions, you know, why did you lose, you know, why were you the, you know, so it's, it's uh, a lot of pressure on these fighters, but uh, therefore you get two fighters that are well prepared, and they're going to give us their all, and we're going to see a great one. And it's not, oh, just last week, it seems like, what you're talking about, it's a very mental thing too, it's not just a physical thing, because there is so much pressure on both of these guys. It's, it's a mental thing, I mean, you have to be mentally strong to, uh, just to endure, I mean, all the, yeah, all the pressure um, from everyone, from from family, from fans, from your whole country. Um, it's it's uh, it's 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 something that I was obviously part of when I was a fighter. But uh, let's just put it this way: I'm glad I'm I'm, I'm in the back seat, just uh, looking uh, out, looking in. So uh, I'm I'm uh, I'm just really looking forward to. It. I'm really excited about this one. Cool.